Well, Madam Secretary, thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. Uh, this is a very special day for Idaho National Laboratory to have you virtually visiting. Hello, everybody. Um, I hope I get a chance to visit you in person sometime soon. I'm sorry that we have to do it this way, but I wanted to make sure that in some way I was able to learn more about the great work that you are doing, and I know it is great. Advanced reactors can be an MVP of meeting our energy and economic goals only if we innovate both on the technology and on how the technology interfaces with society. And INL is working across that spectrum. Here at INL, we don't just talk about advanced reactors, we actually build them. So I want to show you here behind me, we have a full-scale electrically heated prototype of the Marvel reactor. Yeah, Fir, thank you so much. Uh, super interesting. The advanced test reactor is a 250 megawatt reactor. So it is the largest research or test reactor in the world, most powerful. And as Bob Boston said, it is also the coolest reactor in the world. <laughs> you can see that the core internal change out is a, not an easy operation, which is why it takes about 10 months. And you can see the 30 foot uh, in pile tubes going down into the reactor area at the bottom of the reactor vessel. So here is what we call an extreme fast charger. It's capable of charging a, a 300 mile range electric vehicle in just 10 minutes. Uh, so to my right, for example, is the micro reactor experimental test bed that has been designed to host a number of different micro reactor concepts and use electric heating to represent the heat that would be produced by nuclear fuel. Hi, hello, Secretary Guangdong. Uh, welcome to the uh, Power Energy Real-Time Laboratory. Just please follow me to the laboratory itself. So the core capability of this laboratory is our uh, power system real-time digital simulations and uh, hardware in the loop testing. Um, since 2003, INL has had a core focus on detecting and mitigating vulnerabilities and responding to cyber attacks in critical infrastructure. In fact, the lab that I'm coming to you from inside the CyberCorp building is built exactly for this purpose. I mean, that's, that's our weatherman, Jake Gentle. <laughs> Jake. Hey, Secretary, how are you? I'm good. How are you, Jake, really? out there in the cold and snow? Yeah, absolutely. Hey, you know, when we say we're going to do things, we do it, right? <laughs> so we, we came up with some ideas on how you could get a full effect of Idaho National Laboratory and our full-scale power grid, um, and also our mini micro grid here with the mobile substation, mobile command center, awesome. our deployable wind and solar. We're betting big on research and development. We're betting big on deployment. We're betting big on the power of American ingenuity. And that means we're betting big on each and every one of you. And um, from what I have learned before the tour even about INL and our other national labs, you know, I know it's a smart bet. So your work is creating a better tomorrow and it gives me all the confidence in the world that we will overcome the challenges ahead. So thank you for having me. Thank you for the inspiration.